Okay guys, now I'm supposed to share with you guys what happened to my zebra, right? Very unfortunately, my zebra, thanks to my brother, the the brake, the rim, a part of a rim broke, uh, the brake, braking part. So now he has got to change the entire rear rim. Recently, he just changed the front and <laughs> front and rear tube. Mind you, it's front and rear tube. Uh, burst at the same time on the same day so now I am using my spare eco drive right now and yeah as mentioned this is not the 48 volt new eco drive this is still the original normal 36 volt eco drive the old version uh, that's what I meant oh my goodness the amount of sand that's why I was contemplating whether I should just take order or use this road because I know a lot of lorries uh. yeah, anyway this eco drive also about there already uh. the rear brake pads also like cannot really eat already well I received this this was given to me by the distributor of eco drive uh, it's somewhere sometime around last year September or so in fact so it has been a year uh, it's quite well used nothing has been changed I did not change the rear brake pads for wow a year already I come to think of it so I, I'm quite I'm a little bit concerned about the upcoming this break because two two things I know for a fact firstly these brake pads are more expensive bicycle shops will charge more expensive compared to V brakes to change the brake pads secondly you need to change more frequently because as you can see I use this for like wow, one year never change still can eat lah not say it's very jalat lah but yeah man the the durability is there I would say this short clip is from the last episode on the top right click to watch it or check out one of my most updated playlists that I've selected for you fellow riders see you on the streets